Tonight, an incredible story of survival caught on camera. Two strangers bonded together forever after a miracle on the ice. A Charlotte area man collapsed on the ice during a hockey game, but thanks to the quick actions of a fellow player, he is now live to tell his story. NBC Charlotte's Brooke Katz has more. It was supposed to be a fun pickup game here at the Pineville Ice House, but it turned into a life or death situation when one of the players had a heart attack and collapsed. Well, the outcome is just simply miraculous, and um, I'm, I'm truly blessed to, to be here right now. 54-year-old Jib Street was playing a pickup hockey game when suddenly everything went black. I felt lightheaded, um, and that's the last thing I remember. That's Jib collapsing on the ice. He was experiencing sudden cardiac arrest, a life-threatening condition. His teammates rushing over to help. My heart had stopped pumping, and I wasn't breathing, and my organs were shutting down, and I was simply dead. Then an angel appeared on the ice. I did realize how serious this was. Craig Bryant, who was playing on the other team, is an emergency room doctor. He immediately sprang into action. That's him pumping Jib's chest, administering CPR. With no oxygen reaching Jib's brain, every second counted. Your brain can have irreversible damage at the four to six minute mark. So this is uh, one of those situations where time is extremely important. Luckily, the rink had an AED, an automated external defibrillator. For five minutes, Dr. Bryant tried to jumpstart Jib's heart. Then, a miracle on the ice. Bryant was able to revive Street. I think the first thing he said to me was, did I fall asleep? And uh, he, he thought he maybe took a little nap out there on the ice. <laughs> He's my guardian angel and blessed to be here. Jib spent six days in the hospital making a full recovery. To express his gratitude, he gave his new hero his prized possession. You're the greatest hockey player. His jersey from his old hero, hockey superstar Wayne Gretzky. A game that suddenly turned life or death, turning two strangers into the closest of friends. You know, I'll give you a big hug. Absolutely. And I'm very appreciative and thank you so much for saving my life. Street now has a new pacemaker in his chest. He hasn't been back out on the ice yet, but he hopes his close call will motivate other ice rinks everywhere to install defibrillators. Reporting from Pineville, Brooke Katz, NBC Charlotte. Making me tear up over here. What an incredible story. Six minutes for irreversible brain yeah. damage. It took him five minutes. That's amazing. Unbelievable. Wow.